A pan-Nigerian organization, Nigeria First, has frowned at a high court judgment that has narrates former finance minister Kemi Adeosho of forgery. Before her resignation three years ago, Adeosho admitted that her National Youth Service Corps NYC exemption certificate was fabricated. However, despite her self-confession, Adeosho is yet to be prosecuted and recently obtained a court judgment which trivialized her failure to participate in the NYC scheme prior to her appointment. Speaking at a press conference, Nabuja, the group's Secretary General, Comrade Richard Adi, called on the Independent Corrupt Practices and Other Related Offenses Commission, ICPC and Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, to effect Adiosu's arrest and subsequent prosecution. Nigeria Force as an organization at the vanguard of promoting the ideals of democracy and democratic governance abhors a situation where the sensibility of Nigerians will be insulted by the judicial arm of government, as evident in the court's ruling. It must be stated that the case of Kemi Adesu is a crystal clear a case of forgery and the confinement of undue advantage to herself when she presented forged NYC certificates for clearance as a commissioner in Obu States and subsequently as a minister of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. It is also succinct to add that, in law, ignorance is not an excuse. Even we have credible information at our disposals that, indeed, Kemi Adeosun was aware that the NYC certificate in her possession was forged. Yet, she still went ahead to presenting them. Nigeria First is also alarmed that there is an attempt in some quarters to give Kemi Adeosun a clear bill of health because of her passive connection to some influential figures in the country, who in the first place nominated her for the position she held in the political scene in the country since 2011. It is thus the resolution of the leadership of Nigeria First that such actions are unpatriotic and clear case of insulting the sensibility of Nigerians from all walks of life in this critical point of our existence. Nigeria First is citing section 26 1c and 25 1a of the corrupt practices and other related offenses at 2000 and 2000 of the independent corrupt practices commission which is to call on the icpc to effect the arrest and subsequent prosecution of kemia adesu under section 17c and 25b of the corrupt practices and other related Offenses at 2000. The judgment delivered last week at the Federal High Court in Abuja declared that Adeosho needed not to partake in the NYC scheme but to be appointed a minister or contest national or state assembly elections. But the Nigerian Frost said the ex minister must face the full rot of the law for giving herself undue advantage using false presentations.